first ever live airing of Golfers Only. This is a dating service for all of you uh, who need, need to find love. Today, our first, our first contestant, actually our female contestant, is a former Division I golfer. Let's give her a round of applause as she comes on out here. And the reason she's here is because she's been looking for love on all the wrong courses. But we're here to help her out. How do you feel to be here? I'm excited. She's excited. You're excited. I'm excited. Let's bring the men out here. Contestant number one comes to us all the way from Wisconsin. Contestant number two is from Utah. Contestant number three comes to us from Colorado. Let's get this party started with some rules questions. You guys ready? All right, I'm looking at you, contestant number two. What would happen if you showed up six minutes late to your tea time? Um, Nate, I don't understand. I go to bed early, so that doesn't happen. <laughs> this is a hypothetical situation. I'm just going to need to know if you know that answer. Oh, well, if a player is more than five minutes late for the tea, he or she will be disqualified. Ding, 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 he knows how to stop. What happens if a player plays the wrong ball? Is that a serious question? People don't know this. It's, it's happened before. I'm sorry, not everyone knows what the ball is yet. To those unfortunate people, I'll refer to rule 15 3B. Uh, they don't have to correct the mistake of playing the wrong ball at the locker room. I don't get two strokes. Congratulations. <laughs> Contestant number three, if a player would hit their ball into a lateral water hazard, what are their five options? You know, Nate, uh, this question really bugs me. Um, the main reason, if a player hits his ball into the water, I don't understand why the water is a hazard. I mean, if I hit my ball into the water, I would be more than willing to dive in, grab my ball, <laughs> and play it with no penalty. So, I guess that's your, uh, your answer. <laughs> There's a reason you swam in college instead of golf. <laughs> Do we have anyone out there who wants to ask these fine young men? Oh, I have a question. Yeah, go for it. What do you look for in a woman? What do you look for in a woman? <laughs> let's, let's get right into it. <laughs> that, that's a fantastic question. And uh, for me, it's pretty simple. I just look for a good shoulder head drop. <laughs> Thank you for asking. I prefer a woman who walked with a purpose and plays very well. This is actually a tougher question than my first one. I'm going to have to think about this for a sec. Um, excuse me. I think he's over for a lot of time. Red card! Red card! Red card! Um, sir, some of the players in your group, as well as a few parents, have let me know you've been taking a while. I want you to know this is just a warning. You are, you are still able to participate in the rest of this show, but I'm going to need you to think quicker on your feet. Uh, think with a purpose. Think ahead when it's not your turn. Who do you guys think I should choose? Anybody? Contestant number two. Thank <laughs> you. 